You're, You're watching, watching Trio, Trio Travels, Travels in Belize. Belize. <laughs> Woo! Previously on Trio. Anyway, they, here's that. Hey gang, welcome back. Last time on Trio, Bruce, Brenda, John, and Corey joined us aboard Saltair 3, and together we explored the tiny islets and keys of the Belizean Barrier Reef. This time on Trio, we continue sailing the Belizean Barrier Reef with our new crew, including an anxious few moments as we once again navigate up the shallow entrance to the beautiful City River. No. <laughs> Why not? Because I think I had too much last night during our game of chicken foot dominoes. Oh, okay. Yeah. <laughs> and Krista says, at least... Not until we get over the coral bar. The shallow coral yeah. bar that says seven feet and we saw three feet. I think then I'm... you can open the bar after you cross the bar. Actually, I think I need to drink before we go over the bar. <laughs> there's, two, <laughs> there's two shallow bars. There's the I seven know. foot one and then there's the three foot one. Yeah. The three foot one's on the entrance in. Yeah, that one's a nail biter. Three foot. I'm definitely going to get a drink. Uh, no, I thought we were going to catch a fish. I know, but if we don't, then I got frozen pork chops and it's hard to cook when they're frozen. Alright, I'm on it. <laughs> it's a great sail. Head for Long Coco Key. Yeah. Corey and John are reading on the tramps. Cole and I are just chilling in the sun. Fish on! Oh, I was out of the water a second ago. Yeah, it just sunk it out a second ago. Really? It fought that hard? Yeah. It's going so fast again. Look it! Oh, you can't even hold it in! Oh, shit. Alright, we have to find a way to slow down the boat. I'm gonna turn into the wind. Sure, yeah, you can film. That'd be awesome. Is it on? Is it going? Yes, it is. island sticking out there. It makes me think a lot about what's between here and there. Yeah, what other underwater. high parts? Yeah, yeah, underwater. Right. What other potential islands or what islands? So Krista dropped a fairing point up there. Oh, okay, for where we're going. Where we're going, but I, I just feel like it's a little close to some of those. Where are I? Oh, but she didn't do a, she didn't put a line to it, a straight line to no, it. No, she just used right. it to figure out the... Oh, the yeah, right. Because yeah. the cursor will take you and show you what your heading is. Yeah. 
to port just a bit. Go to the port. Okay. okay, straight ahead. Roger. Are you in neutral, right, babe? Yep. Ready, Cole? Yep. Go. Yeah, if you're filming here, you can see that anchor right in the bottom. Go, Cole. Yep. Cole, you make it look easy. It is easy. Footwork. Still in reverse? Yep. It's so clear you could actually watch your anchor drag. So this is Pompeian Key, just north of, what the hell were we just now? <laughs> Rangwana Key. And then Circle Key is off in the distance. Beautiful spot. Going to shore to see our friends Antonio and Rodrigo. Rodrigo. Amigos! And I decided to try it. <laughs> oh, are we gonna put aliens out today? We knew we were gonna do that. Yeah. Now it's gonna wait till tomorrow. We're gonna tomorrow. It's so good tonight, you can sit there with the cars from there. <laughs> Gracias. Yeah. Yeah. You said? Step on the one if you need to. Go, go, okay. Nice. Like the ladder. Yeah. Antonio. Antonio. Bruce, nice to meet you. Oh, poquito espanol for me, so yeah, sorry. Okay, okay. Rodrigo. John. Rodrigo. Okay. Hi. Good to see you again. Yeah. Rodrigo! Hey. Todo bien? Si, sí, okay, dude. Si, sí, dude. Hola. 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 Oh my goodness. I'm so excited. Oh, yes. Gracias. Oh. This is when you yeah. get those bamboo straws. <laughs> yes. Mm -hmm. Para otro. Hi, thank you. Oh, I got it. Sorry. Two hands. You check that one. Thank you. All of us. Si, si, ¿Qué pasó con el otro amigo del otro? Ah, Mexico. Mexico. Oh, Mexico. Mexico. Sí. Uh, oh, yeah. Okay. Muchas gracias. 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 Grac
No problem, mi amigos. Caminar. No hay problema. No hay problema. No hay problema. Puede caminar todo, todo, todo. No hay mucho problema. Gracias, señor. Gracias, señor. Your morning's entertainment. <laughs> awesome. That's what we're called. No, no, I can't. Encore, encore. We're on day four of our charter. We're making up some uh, Monte Cristo sandwiches and we've got Brenda and Bruce on the helm today. Checking the sail. Got some chilling going on. Seas are good. Wind is great. It's a nice sail today. We got 11 knots of wind. We're going 5.3 knots of speed. What do you think, Cap? I think this is easy sailing for me today. <laughs> You're off the hook. <laughs> we got some crew. I said literally we were off the hook. Yeah. <laughs> that was last night we were off the hook. <laughs> yeah. We were off the chain last night. We're on a rum run today. Great it's day. a rum run to City Marina. <laughs> we checked all the water. last time has drifted away so hopefully there's no underwater remnants of it Five and a half feet. there is still some of the remnants of the tree Brad okay. <laughs> oh yeah I see it so I don't know if you want to um, go on the route that we've taken because if there's more trees submerged and we get yeah. tangled in it then we're kind of screwed yeah because there's no room between it and the marker or it and the shore it's like right in the middle right so we'll just hug the yes. marker on starboard, yeah? Okay, so... That's what we did before. Yeah, I know. 
Well, when we get closer, you'll see if there's enough room between the tree and the... In incoming bug. Well, can you come and grab the handheld and go zero nine? They got a way shallower draft though, so it's not really going to be that helpful. Uh, Christo, are you going to go on the closest drop side of that four feet? Three. We're not sure yet because last time the tree was bigger. The rest of it's over there somewhere. I see there's a piece of it over there. Yeah. They went on the other side, so I guess we'll just do it and go closer to this. But don't forget this marker. Yeah, well, they're not going around it either, so. Okay. Sounds good. Two nine. That's fun. Boys on the starboard side. We'll just go for it. Tie tide. He says it's high tide right now. Anyway. Go closer to the marker. Right. Two point six feet. State up state of port looks deeper. So hard to see. You can see the bottom, but you can't get any sense of what depth it is. Yeah. Did you touch last time? Uh, nope. Should be good now. Starts climbing now. Yay! Look at you, little savant, eh? <laughs> Two feet, lots of water. Yeah. <laughs> Talk about savant, you're the one drinking a beer. I trust you. <laughs> right. <laughs> all the nerves just not. Four feet. Four feet. Wow, this is absolutely beautiful. Good job, Cap. <laughs> it's a little easier when I know it's all mud. Yeah, then you just skid across the... Right, I felt this touch. Yeah, yeah really I didn't. It was so hard to see the bottom, like you can't get a sense for what the depth is. And I actually think that um, some of that reading must have been that the water's churned up because, well, you, like you said, you did feel a touch. But what was the lowest reading you saw? 0 0.4. 0.4. Yes, and we've touched when a reading's been 0.7. Now you got to understand sonar is not 100% perfect it bounces off of anything that's down there like yeah like grass or yeah or sea fans right or thick mud that happened to be stirred up a little bit so. really when it's saying 1.0 and under there's cause for alarm <laughs> yeah. but this is it's worth it right it's beautiful Afternoon. Afternoon, afternoon. Thank you. It's nice to be back. Now Brenda just watch the fenders so that when we come in we are hitting where we need to and sometimes you need to adjust them. We've got lines on deck. Hali, help her, Hali, this time, um, Minty. Tired to come up, tired to come up. Yeah.
The back is better tight than we can get off. Oh, no way. <laughs> 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 YouTube!